starting to get to the nitty gritty now. Only four teams remain alive in the cup, and the scene is set for what should be an exciting semi final. Who will make it through? We have all the action for you live on EA TV. Hello, great to have the pleasure of your company and welcome to our coverage of this semi-final here at the 2024 UEFA European Championship. My name is Derek Ray here on the commentary position and sitting next to me providing all the tactical analysis is Stuart Robson. Keen anticipation ahead of this colossal encounter. It's Germany against Denmark. Well, what a match-up between these two excellent teams. Both have played really well to reach this stage of the tournament. But which one is going to go through to the final? I think this could be really close today. Here's the starting lineup for Germany. Well, on paper, they look a very balanced team. But the three advanced midfielders must at times make runs beyond the centre forward. Otherwise, they might just lack a bit of penetration. And the starting lineup for Denmark. Kasper Schmeichel stands between the posts. Andreas Christensen starts alongside Yannick Vestergaard in central defense. Pierre Emil Hoybier plays alongside Christian Eriksen in the center of midfield. And the tactical configuration has two players in attack from the very outset. And the game begins. Well, good run and good ball control. Straight down the throat of Neuer. Musiala. And possession lost by Germany. Do they mean business on this occasion? Oh, an incredible clearance. I must say, I didn't see that coming. Musiala. Joshua Kimmich. And a textbook interception. Christian Eriksen now. Jonas Wint, nicely cut out. Gundogan threading it through. It could be for Zane. And a fine stop. Course. He must finish. Oh, that was a chance to give them an early advantage. Well, they should be off to a flyer here. And that was a poor effort. He must hit the target. Not to like about that pass. And players waiting in the centre. Well, that's how to outwit your opponent. Can they nudge in front? Oh, he couldn't outwit the keeper. And over 
from Ericsson. Relatively straightforward to mop up defensively. Well, I must say, a promising avenue of attack favoured by Leroy Zane. A fine reading of the situation. And sent in by Sané. Well, threat averted. Commitment to passing and attacking Gundogan. He read the situation defensively and did his job. Rasmus Hoylun. Well, the referee allowing the play to flow. Happy to take on the shot. Really good diving stop to make sure the threat came to nothing. Corner kick taken by Christian Eriksen. And clearing his lines. That's the kind of shielding play you expect from him. Really getting stuck in. To take the lead. Well, they're going to feel, aren't they, that that was an opportunity squandered. Well, from that position, it should be 1-0 now. Great chance for them. Gundogan and slipped through by Ilkay Gundogan and a goal! The opening statement of the semi-final how important could that prove to be? Well here it is again he hits this so sweetly doesn't he? That's a brilliant goal from a top class player ball is moving once more how important will that opening goal prove to be Huylund moving the ball forward with purpose but quick thinking defensively Joshua Kimmich A wilting under the pressure and now they try to go forward Havertz Kai Havertz being egged on by the crowd oh not to be that would have put them well on their way Stuart well that could prove to be a big miss surely has to score there Kimmich. Now with course. Keeper getting the touch. Well, that's really sound goalkeeping, not letting the opposition have any scraps. And holding on to it at the second time of asking. Well, he stopped them in their tracks. Andy. Oh, managing to beat him, but stout defending when it mattered. Good move in the making from Germany. Corner kick awarded, and let's see if this will help them 
add to the lead. over by Kroos not the result from the set piece they were looking for well Germany have had a lot of the ball during the last 15 minutes as you can see and have been threatening with it surely it's only a matter Gundogan oh a smart stop and the perfect position to read it This might be ideal for the counter. And we are going to have two additional minutes. This looks more than decent. And quick thinking defensively. Well, it could be on for him here. That ball was put into the right area, but no one able to capitalise. Gives it a go. Well, very effective goalkeeping to touch it over. Well, for good measure, we can see it again, but clearly not over the line. Can be no debate over that decision. <laughs> Cross with the corner, and the keeper more than equal to it. That is that for the first half here. a chance to give them an early advantage well they should be off to a flyer here and that was a poor effort he must hit can they nudge in front oh he couldn't outwit the keeper really good diving stop to make sure the threat came to nothing Really getting stuck in to take the lead. Well, they're going to feel, aren't they, that that was an opportunity squandered. Well, from that position, it should be 1-0 now. Gundogan. And slipped through by Ilkay Gundogan. And a goal! The opening statement in this semi-final. How important could that prove to be? of goalkeeping to touch it over. So underway once more. Germany with the lead. But this game far from being done and dusted. work out, Ilkay Gundogan's in behind, and a goal! How about that? As they increase their advantage, and who's to say they won't be going to the final at this rate? Well, as you can see, he gave the keeper no chance there. He looked so confident, didn't he? That's a cool finish. Uh, back underway with the scoreline standing at 2-0. Jamal Musiala. That's a good ball. And he did well to cut it out. And he could be in proper trouble here. And a squandered opportunity there. 
They've decided that now is the time to go to the bench. Well, that is how to play advantage. Fine cross into the middle. Well blocked, but he must clear it away. Leroy Zane. This is Kroos. Kai Havertz. Quite possibly a yellow card as the flow was stopped. Well, he's had his name taken by the referee. Well, he knew he was going to get booked. It's a poor tackle, really. They will now make use of the substitute's bench. Good effort here! And the keeper grabbing hold of that free kick. Mikael Damsgaard. Attacking with vigour. A fine reading of the situation. So a half an hour remaining. Germany in a position of menace. And Kai Havertz. Goalkeeping of the highest order. Well, he's got to be pleased with that save. It's absolutely magnificent. Corner kick delivery from Tony Kroos. Oh, disappointing clearance. No spillage from the goalkeeper. Routine. And the referee allowing the play to flow. Great vision from Leroy Zane. And a simple clearance, a good one. Bar running with the ball confidently but they took care of the situation defensively opportunity here opportunity squandered and they really need to give themselves a lift well if they're going to get back into this they need to take those sort of chances well the referee saw it as a bookable offence I think he's got it absolutely right that was a poor challenge you have to say and time for the change now Andri. Florian Wirtz. It did look on for them, but not to be. Not the best challenge, free kick. And nicely over the top. Reading it through. And it's still on for him. And that, a piece of goalkeeping you're going to see again and again and again. And he's fired over the corner. 
Well, not away properly. Oh, blocked it! A quarter of an hour remaining here. Oh, what a top-notch pass. Is it going to be Sané? Really good diving save. Well, they've decided to make a change. Delivering it. Half-hearted clearance. Rudiger. Nicely blocked. Now, who can he play it to? Kimi. Zane in the middle. Well, still an issue here. Gundogan! Well, the keeper kept it out with a minimum of fuss, but it wasn't a great effort. Paulsen. And the referee playing advantage. And running room in the wide position. Could pull one back here. Which he does! And maybe, just maybe, there's enough time for an equaliser. It would be quite the frenetic turnaround. Well, here it is again. And having got a touch on it, he'll be a little bit disappointed he didn't keep it out. It was a good effort, though. So on with the match. 2-1 is the scoreline. What's going to happen next? Kimmich. Raum. We might very well have late excitement here. Five minutes to go. And just one goal between them. He has teammates around him. Not getting it forward, but they need an equaliser. But a good piece of defending to bring it to an end. Can they do something positive on the counter-attack? keeper time really is of the essence what can they do from this situation trying to deliver it accurately and in a crowded area the keeper has managed to get there And the referee has deemed that an additional four minutes are in order. Gundogan. Well, oh, that's splendid play. Well, an excellent sliding tackle, and it had to be. Under a fair bit of pressure. Sané. Now with Gundogan. Good idea. Oh, that's a fine save. And there it is, the full-time whistle. The host nation have done it. Germany through to the final of the Euros. Well, it was far from easy at times. They'll certainly know they've been in a match today, but these are the sort of games you have to get through if you want to win silverware. They've done that, and now they can turn their attention to that final. What a game that should be. As a footballer, you can never be quite sure how it's all going to unfold. But suffice it to say, it unfolded positively for Gundogan. Well, he scored a good goal, and if I was his coach, I certainly wouldn't be worried by him missing a couple of chances. The fact is, he was a constant threat today. Might work out. 
Ilkay Gundogan's in behind. And a goal! How about that? As they increase their advantage. And, and it's still on for him. And that, a piece of goalkeeping you're going to see again and again and again. Is it going to be Zane? Really good diving save. Well, they've decided to make a change. And running room in the wide position. Could pull one back here. Which he does! And maybe, just maybe, there's enough time for an equaliser. It would be quite the frenetic turnaround. Oh, he couldn't outwit the keeper. Time really is of the essence. What can they do from this situation?